guys and welcome back to another commentary. In this episode, I talk about how to be a semi successful YouTuber like me. Um, so for the first tip, if you want to be a successful YouTuber, you have to know what you're recording about. And by that I mean, don't make, don't make a fool of yourself going, uh, uh, right, I'm gonna, uh, and then have to put it out in some, um, decent editing software. If you do have to do that though, I recommend for editing software, if you're on Windows, um, Windows Movie Maker, and if you're on Mac, iMovie, which is the, um, built-in e built editing software in the Mac. So... Now, now, now that you're not messing up, going, uh, uh, I'm recording this, uh, uh, and let's go on to our second tip. Upload regularly. You don't want, you don't want to be one of those people that, when viewers go on to, go on to your channel, um, they see you haven't uploaded in like a month. And um, like, I know a couple of people that haven't uploaded in like a month. Um, one of them being <laughs> he hasn't uploaded in like two months. So upload regularly. That's my number two top. Number three. Make sure that you're being watched by putting a very long description and putting some tags in. You don't want to be, you don't want to have one of those inscriptions that's just like, my Twitter, my Instagram, my Snapchat or whatever. And, and I know my descriptions are sometimes like that. But I'm now start, started writing long description. Long descriptions. My full stop tip. Have good ed editing software um, to edit with. You don't, don't want to be scammed into downloading um, some editing software um, that doesn't even work. The editing software that I recommend for editing is either video pad which you have to pay for but it's only like twenty dollars I mean twenty pounds <laughs> sorry um um and if you're on Mac then there's one built right there's one built right in called iMovie and that's really good for, for, for starting out. If you if you want to upgrade to something like Final Cut or Screenflow, then feel free. But for starting out, that's what I recommend. And my fifth top tip is just enjoy yourself. You don't want to be one of those people. It just goes. It doesn't enjoy making videos. There's no point in making videos if you don't enjoy them. If you don't enjoy making them. Like sometimes, I spend so long editing videos that I just don't enjoy it. But. When I um, record these commentaries, I do because obviously I'm having fun. Anyway, yeah, that's my, those are my top tips for you. And I will see you next time for another commentary. Goodbye.